Alright guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to calculate the number of uh, sodium ions that are present in 5.6 grams of uh, sodium sulfate. Molar mass of sodium sulfate is given to you. And this is uh, your given. This is just a helpful known fact. Okay, save time. Alright, take the given, which is the 5.63 grams of Na2SO4 and put that over 1. Okay. Now, if this is grams of Na2SO4, then down here will be grams of Na2SO4. Now, Notice that this is blank. The reason why this is blank is, well, we need the molar mass here. So we're going to write that number down. This is 142.04. Now up here, since this is molar mass, I'm going to write 1 mole of Na2SO4. Now, what I, what I need to do next is match up the units. This is moles of Na2SO4 so down here I'm going to write one mole of Na2SO4. Now watch this. Here I've got one mole of Na2SO4. Now how many moles of sodium do I have here? I've actually got two moles because two times one is two. I've actually got two moles of sodium. Now I could go ahead and write down that I've got two moles of Na and then over here in one mole of something is this many ions. But what I can go ahead and do is this. I know that since I've got two moles of Na plus one, okay, I know I've got that. So I've got two moles of Na plus one. And I can actually stop there because I've got everything that I need. Now the only thing I'm going to add on there is ions. And I'm actually done because I have calculated the number of moles of sodium ions. Now the only reason why I'm not going to use the 6.02 times 10 to the 23rd number here is it wants to know moles. It's not asking how many ions are there of sodium ions. <laughs> they want to know how many moles of sodium ions there are. So all that I have to do is just write down two moles of Na plus one ions. That's it. That's how simple this calculation is. All that they're trying to do here is trying to make sure that you know that if you have one mole of this then you know you've got two moles of sodium, you've got one mole of sulfur, and you've got four moles, four moles of oxygen. But since they're dealing with an ion here, they want you to know that you've got two moles of Na plus one ions. Okay? And if you had, if you want to know about sulfate ions, then you would write down that you'd have one SO4 here, one mole of sulfate ions. But luckily for us, they just ask about Na plus one. So that, that's the nice part of it. Anyway, we need to put this in on a calculator. So let's turn the calculator on. There it is. Let's clear it out and let's punch it in. We've got uh, 5.63 times 2 is that number divided by 142.04 and that gives us this number. I'll write it down for us to see. 0 0.079273444 one. Okay, now I don't need all those numbers. I just really need three sig figs. These two are insignificant but one, two, three. These are important. Now that can round. So my answer is 0 0.0793 and it would be moles of Na plus 1 and then write the word ions on there. And that's it. And you're done. It's that simple. Sorry. <laughs> Just want to darken that up. Now, remember, if they would have just wanted two moles of sodium, that's all that we would have written. But since they just want to have sodium ions, moles of sodium ions, I just have plus one and ions on there, and I'm done. <laughs> Alright, well, I hope this video helps, guys.